My wife, Marilena, and I are full-time missionaries with Campus Crusade for Christ here in Panama. We work in Panama City and we also work throughout the country in some very rural villages like this one we're at today. Uh, the name of this village is Cunanega. Our overall vision is to work with churches throughout the country and churches even in some of these very rural villages where they don't have access to Bible training and uh, to bring in pastors and to do teaching and training to equip them to lead and equip their people in the villages to reach their people more effectively for Christ. After being associate pastor for five years in Arizona and staying a little there, we came to Panama about three years ago and I remember saying to a, our their director, national director, don't even think that we are going to be the pastors of the church. Little did I know that God had really planned this for us. So since March of 2008, we are pastoring La Comunidad Church, which is a church in the city. And we mainly have people between ages 23 to their 30s, which is a very young church. But what we love about it is the people have a heart to reach out to others. And it is a privilege for my husband and I to be pastoring that church. We can see the growth of the people and it's just an excitement to, to also be in that level. We do a lot of personal coaching and we are seeing how people are not only growing spiritually but also in their emotions. So that's something that we uh, really pray. We wanted to have a healthy church and God is giving us that. We also have a short-term missions uh, ministry called Missions Experience and we work with church groups and organizations, short-term missions organizations. Uh, we've even worked with doctors and we've brought them in to do medical clinics. And the vision of this ministry is a short-term mission with a long-term vision. And the idea is not just to go in and do uh, four or five days or a week's worth of ministry, but it's also to go into a village and expose people to the need and expose people to uh, just begin to ask questions and begin to really think creatively how they can use their gifts, talents, and abilities to become long-term solutions to problems and stay in contact with us down here. We're on the ground down here and really work together as a community wherever we live, whatever country we live in, uh, and out of that relationship to build um, opportunities for these people to really begin to change their lives.